WFNN. Headline News Update. Hi everyone, Basil Chapman on this Tuesday, November the 16th. We're looking at the Dow up 174, 36,266, still 300 points under the 36,565 all-time high of the 8th of November. This is very good action above the nine-period moving average. And uh, we, I said if the Dow is able to close in the 36,270 uh, level or higher, then we've got to consider there's a chance that we could uh, retest the uh, all-time high uh, sooner rather than later. Uh, key support this week will be in that 30,000 area. Let's go to the S&P. S&P is, in a way, although it's, um, it's doing well, it's lagging a little bit the Dow just at the moment. It's up 14 at 46.97 under the 47.18 all-time high <clears throat> of just over a week ago. And here, if it starts to trade in the 47.12 area, that's going to be very good. If it slides underneath 46.48, it says, uh-oh, stalling action. So far, so good. QQQ, NDX 100. Uh, a nice day after yesterday's uh, reason, kind of a relatively weak session. It's up at 39, 395.90. It's up 1.32. It's just testing the Chapman Wave inside track, a repellent zone. We'll see what happens there. If it's able to get to the 397 area, that's very good action. If it starts to stall and takes out 393 support, not so good. IWM, the Russell 2000. Acting quite weak here. It was the leader, and now it's kind of stalling. It's not bad. It's just stalling action down 94 cents at 237. Gold, gold's been doing very nicely today. I had a pop to the upside, made a new recovery high at 1879. Now pulling back five points at 1861. A little digestive phase after a fabulous uh, week and a half. And uh, the dollar is still making new recovery highs at 95.72. This is really good action. And I've been saying for about a few days now since the end of last week that I think Bitcoin was close to having a digestive phase. Maybe gold takes over in a sense. Uh, so it is. Bitcoin is down almost 3,000 at 50,900. And you've got the TLT. This is very important. The TLT has pulled back very sharply. That's bonds. But it is trying to raise today at 55 cents. I'll be back in a moment for the Tiger Technicians Hour. And don't forget tonight, I'm going to be the guest speaker at the Boston, um, the Boston Investors Group. I'll be back in a moment. We'll talk about that when I get back for the Tiger Technicians Hour. Check out my 